out here dang i'm about to get bumps on my back trey open the door trey open the door right now uh who's that i don't even know um just pretend like she ain't here okay okay trey open this the so why took you so long to open the door oh you probably got some other girl in here Oh, so you'd probably take care of her kids, but you can't even come to my house and take care of your own? See, no, that's petty, Trey. That's very petty. That's very petty. What are you even talking about? What kids? You make me sick. You make me sick to my stomach. And where my child support money at? For real? That's all you had to come in over here for? For some child support money? Are you serious, Lay? It is 2 o'clock in the morning, bro. Waking people up when they sleep. Um, well, sir, you were you were a bit late, so, <laughs> you know, I just had to come here and collect my coin. <laughs> so, where, where's my money, Trey? Where's my money? Because you owe me $10.2 thousand dollars. Girl, are you slow? You mean $10? Um, uh, that's, that's not how much the paper said. You came all your way over here to collect some ten dollars. You that desperate for some ten dollars? Trey, don't play with me right now. I need my money. Where's my money? And I know it's just not ten dollars, cause them people wouldn't lie to me. Look at look at the paper. You are here to collect ten dollars. Ten dollars? No, I could have sworn it was more than that. You came over here to collect ten dollars, Blay. Um, who is this? Um, who are you? Girl, I am his boyfriend, his husband. Who are you? Trey. <laughs> Trey! Hold up. <laughs> Slow your roll. Who, who who is this right now? This has to be a joke. What am I looking at? You're looking at his soon to be husband um you look like a bum yourself so i mean you just step off our porch and go back home to your kids <laughs> while he's going to be taking care of me oh nah see you got the wrong one because i came here to collect my child support money and i'm just trying to figure out who are you like who brought you into the conversation well, I can jump into any conversation that I want to because I am his husband. And if my husband has a problem, I'm going to jump in here and solve it. You feel me? Oh, okay, okay. So I see you got potential. Okay, whatever. But Trey, you need to get her out of the house right now. Um, Trey, you need to come and take care of your kids. So you got to pick which one. Um. Pick one, Trey, because you're taking too long for me. Right, you're taking a little bit too long for me. <laughs> it's giving time vibes, alarm clock. See, this is why I don't do relationships, bro. Huh? Relationships? Relationships? Hold on, so I know you did not just come for me because I took care of you your whole entire relationship with me because do not play with me you ate every day and you went to work every day so what was wrong you broke up with me for what um and i know you're not coming from me because you was just not saying that to me hey 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 i'm just saying like y'all bogus like y'all tripping over what some ten dollars like let's just cut the bs because you you don't even take a bath every day <gasps> and you you leave your kids at home. I be trying to see the kids and you never let me. But as soon as the money get involved, you want me to take care of them. That don't make no sense. That don't make no sense, Lay. I know he did not just come for my whole life like that. So, what I'm gonna need y'all to do is lower your tone and get back to what y'all was doing. You feel me? 
See, uh uh-uh, because I can do way better than this. Girl, you really can. Trey is a bum. He can't do nothing for you. Right, right. You know what? Girl, you want some drinks? Yes, girl, I would love some drinks. Come on, let's go. Period. And Trey, you can say goodbye to this ring because I'm gone. (gasps) You heard what she said, Trey. You heard what she said. Purr, big purr. Come on, girl, let's get in the car. (laughs) You want to go to Dave and Buster's? Because my kid's at home. Wow. That's crazy. Oh, for some $10. You know what? They ain't even coming back here. I'm locking the door. Forget this. Girl, I don't even know why you pulled up with his mess. Girl, don't come for me. What about you? You just said you was going to be his next husband. Like, where did that come from? I don't even know, but he's a good man, but just not for me. Plus, he farts too much. Girl, I had that same problem. Mr. Farty Pants always been farting for his whole life. That's why, another reason why I'm glad we done with that relationship. Even when we was having King, he farted during my birth. Like... We had to get kicked out because King couldn't take the oxygen in there. Like, the chemicals was reacting to his soul. Like, he low-key would have killed my baby with his fart. Dang. Well, I remember this one time when me and him went to go visit my parents' house because they wanted to know him. And he was, like, farting up the place. And they literally called me and said, he can't come over there no more. Like, I can't even introduce you to my parents without you farting everywhere. Like, come on. Can you get some class? Girl, no. But cheers. Cheers to leaving Trey. Cheers to leaving Trey. Girl, I like you. Ah, purr. Big purr.